All right, here we have a <coughs> Cambridge KJV Pit Minion. And this, this is a first edition Pit Minion. So this has the regular verse by verse style format as opposed to the new format, which um, I will detail in later videos if you do not know about it already. And this, as you can see, I've had this rebound. It is not what you would normally get. This is bound in sheepskin. I have Holy Bible KJV there on the back, front and back. Um, and this has been rebound with a pasted down method. Also, but it was done very well. I have put Bible tabs on this one as well, as you see. And it has two red ribbons. Um, I have not used this either much since it's been rebound. But there's one. So you've got a, uh, two red bit ribbons, of course. Um, these are much thicker than what you would get on a original Pit Minion. Um, but the contents are going to be the same. So if you get a first edition Pit Minion, this is what you'd be looking at. They'll come up on eBay sometimes. Um, there was just one up there. Um, I, think, I think it sold, but I saw it. Uh, and it was, it, they won like 50 bucks for it. It wasn't a leather bound. I don't think it was a, the simulation um, type stuff, but it was a good price for a first edition Pit Minion, so I thought I would throw that out there. You can find good deals there sometimes. You've got Holy Bible containing the Old and New Testaments, and you have the Epistle Dedicatory. Names and order of the books of the Old Testament. Lost of words with their pronunciation. Here you have a bunch of the names and how to pronounce them. And then the first book of Moses. Excuse me again, called Genesis. Chapter 1, and you can see the first edition was just laid out in verse-by-verse verse format. Small type, readable type, uh, if you have healthy eyes. Um, And this is art gilted with deep red art gilt. And I cannot tell you if this edition, the first edition, uh, originally came with that or if this was added later to me. It looks original to me. I've seen people who do it themselves with um, archival ink and it, it just looks different. So I'm pretty sure this was original originally art gilt in that way um, before I got it. I had got it and somebody had tried to rebind it themselves with a um, a blue cover, which I actually still have, but it didn't get out. Um, and it, it fell off because they didn't do it properly, didn't use the right glue and everything else. Um, so I had to take it in and get it redone, but I'm glad I did because it's you know, one of a kind now. And uh, I really like this this Bible. Um, anyway, getting more into it here. I get into Psalms. Psalms is just verse by verse. Psalms and Proverbs. Um, see there. And it has a little bit. She added a little bit of a yap, as you can see, 
to protect these um, these tabs, which is pretty neat. And she rebound it for me. That was a local binder. Doesn't have anything online, unfortunately, um, that I know of anyway. So, um, but if you want um, a Bible rebound or um, have one that maybe you didn't spend as much money on, it's worth getting it rebound. Yeah. By a professional. Um, get into the New Testament for Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Matthew. And as you can see, it is not red letter. This is also black letter. We'll get into Revelation. Get to the end of Revelation. Revelation 22, the end. And this had a dedication page in it. It was removed um, when they bound it because it had somebody else's name on it. So I just let them go ahead and take that out. And then you have a blank page. You have your model number, which is KJ182B608536995. And that's the end. That's it back page so there is a my name is on this as you see too everybody's gonna know my full name so uh you know anyway um and i got it done in the silver for something different but very nice uh very nice bible that is the king james version pit minion reference bible in uh, rebound in sheepskin. This is the first edition. And on if this is the original box, which it should be, um, this was originally done in black bonded leather. It says so. This would have been a bonded leather uh, Bible. But there's that one. God bless.